now understand that this is how you're going to run the loop on any page wherever you want to uh, display the content of the post. So what I'm going to do is basically I'll come back to my index.php and this is where I'm going ahead and running everything. So first of all I also want to display the page title because if you notice we are currently on the blog page right you take a look at this URL I clicked on the blog page so I should be able to see the heading also so we want to be able to first show the heading and then we can do the grid system etc okay so what I'm going to do is if the post is available then inside of a container I'm wanting to open a PHP tag over here just want to keep this separate and then inside of this I can check now this heading so I don't want to be showing this heading if the user is on a single post page I want to show it probably when the user is on the home page or on the front page right so how do I check that information so how do I know if I'm on a home page well there's a function available in WordPress called is home okay so if you take a look if, you, if I hit command B on my PHP storm I have this function available the job of this is to determine whether the query is for the blog home page and we are wanting to check that so whether or not you are on the blog home page this function is going to return true so if you take a look it uses the WP query global variable which contains the WordPress query and if that is set then it's just going to call the function which is is home and now if you take a look uh, it checks if is home value returns to be true okay so you can get deep into it if you want to understand how this thing is working but to sum it up it tells you whether you are on the blog home page or not and that's what we want to check right and if you are not on the front page so we can check is front page okay so if you're not on the front page which we have set to a home page right our front page which is if I click on the this is our front page right so as long as it's not the front page and it is a blog page then go ahead and show me the heading of the page okay so I want to be able to see the heading of this page because this is this is the blog page if I click on edit you can see there's a title so I want to show this title actually so in order for us to show the title uh, we do have the function available so before we do that I'm just going to write some HTML so I'll say header so it's going to be your page header and let's give it a class I'm going to give some margin to it MB5 margin bottom 5 and then I'm going to have H1 and then class I can give it a class of page title and then screen reader text and then inside of this I can do single post title so there's a function in WordPress which gets me the post title uh, which is the page title actually so if you take a look displays the retrieve the page title for the post so it gives me the page title so it, okay awesome and you can prefix something if you want uh, by passing that as a parameter in this case we don't need that so we'll just stick to this okay great so now if I view this page which is our blog page now you can see that we have this title available which is great that's exactly what we wanted so if you do an inspect element you can see that we have this heading right awesome great perfect